June's an exciting month to plan summer travel, and there's beautiful places for you to see, and some exciting aspects to get you moving. Here's what they mean for your sign. The month begins as Mercury trines Mars and Venus trines Jupiter. Virgo, Mercury in your 10th house of status trines Mars in your 6th house of daily routines. So state your ideas and your ambitions clearly. Also, use your elbow grease to impress people who can help open doors for your success. At the same time, Venus in the 11th house of associates tells you to socialize with friends and help improve the world a little bit. Her trying to Jupiter in your third house of the mind helps you assimilate knowledge and communicate your ideas to others with a little panache. The Sun squares Neptune on June 7th. Virgo, the Sun in your 10th house of status, illuminates your career and need for social recognition. You can handle little details in big plans. <laughs> Make new contacts, sign deals, and move ahead with your career. However, a square from Neptune in the seventh house of partners can bring some challenges through your relationships. Listen carefully to what people are saying and read between the lines, for they may be a little bit confused. Do not take foolish risks in public and live within the letter of the law. Guard your good reputation. Venus squares Uranus on June 14th. Virgo, Venus in the 12th house of limitations inspires you to spend some time alone. Make sure you keep your actions and your thoughts above board. No secret romances or pleasures allowed. However, her square to disruptive Uranus in your ninth house of the higher mind may shake up your beliefs. Be careful with some of the unusual ideas you encounter. It's nice to have friendly debates, but religious and political differences can become too heated. So keep your cool. Neptune goes retrograde on June 18th. Virgo, Neptune is retrograde in your seventh house of partners. Now, Neptune is always subtle, but now his energy can bring confusion in your relationships. The actions of your partners may be confusing, for they might be expressing mixed emotions and mixed feelings, and they don't know what they want. <laughs> the same may be true when working with the public. What they say and what they do may be two different things. Protect your reputation. Reevaluate what you expect from and what you give to others in a relationship or a business partnership. Mars goes retrograde on June 26. Virgo, Mars is transiting your sixth house of daily routines. His energy stimulates you to work. Woo! You need to focus on important issues and have a sense of purpose. Now, when he goes retrograde, consider the actions you have taken in your work. Are there better ways to do things and be more productive? Don't fight the system without cause and watch your nerves, your health, and your habit patterns. You need to develop efficiency, you need to keep focused, and if possible, learn how to use new technology to make your life easier. These predictions are based on your sun sign. If you'd like more accurate predictions based on your time, date, and place of birth, I would suggest you go to my website, professorastrology.com, to the readings page where you can order a transit chart which will tell you exactly what's coming for you for the next 12 months. I'd like to thank you for watching. I'd like to thank you for listening. I hope you will share these videos with your friends because they're free. <laughs> I hope you have a very good month. Thanks again.